Cisco Finesse Screen Pop. What is Screen Pop? In call centers, a Screen Pop is a window or a dialog box that autonomously appears on agent's desktop, displaying information for a call that's simultaneously routed to that agent's phone. In addition to delivering this basic Screen Pop functionality, Cisco Finesse provides developers the ability to create their own gadgets to pop other relevant piece of information upon a call's arrival. Two screen pop approaches will be covered. The workflow based approach easily automates common repetitive agent tasks by configuring actions, workflows, and team assignments from Finesse admin interface. The gadget based approach enables advanced screen pops and more with the use of simple JavaScript programming. So let's take a look at an example screen pop for both of these approaches. We will begin with the workflow based approach and our objective will be to screen pop Google search results uh, upon a call's arrival and we will make use of caller data to create that search result. So let's start by logging into the Cisco Finesse admin interface with our admin credentials. Click on the workflow tab. So we're going to review what we already configured here. We will start with a workflow action. Give it a descriptive name. Select browser pop as its type and it will be handled by the Finesse desktop and our objective is to pop uh, Google search results so we will enter the Google search URL into our browser URL field here and we will select call variables 4 and 5 by clicking on this icon which brings up a, a drop down menu where we can select any call variable that we would like to use. Before we exit, we can test and see how it works. So just provide some sample values for call variable 4 and 5 and click open. And Google search results with our entered text displays, which is great. So we can save this action, and next is to create a workflow. So let's review our workflow. This is a, a workflow that uh, is triggered when a call arrives, and there are four other options as shown here. Uh, click Add and select the action that was added recently and click Save. So we have an action which is associated with a workflow. The last step here in the admin interface is to assign this workflow to a team. Select Team Resources and select a team available to you. Click the Workflows tab and click Add and select the workflow that was created recently and click Save. And this is all that's necessary in the Finesse Admin Interface. So we can sign out and switch to our Agent Interface and log in our test agent John Summit. So we're going to make John ready so we can send a test call using our system over here. Great. So the test call arrived at Finesse and was auto answered. As soon as the call arrived, a screen pop appeared on John's desktop in a, a separate tab within the same browser window. And this is completely up to the browser settings of the browser that John is using. 
and our search string is Brookline weather and let's go back to our color data within finesse as you can see in the default call control gadget we have Brookline and weather as our call variables so we simply took those call data pushed it into google.com and displayed these search results in three simple steps our next approach is the gadget based so we're going to disconnect our call and also log out our agent so for the gadget based approach we're going to utilize the sample screen pop gadget which is available for you at our developer center log into developer center and select collaboration within the collaboration page you will see finesse sample gadgets click on that and two-thirds of the way down you will see the screen pop sample gadget go ahead and download it to your laptop and extract the zip package into either your own system or ideally the web server that will host the gadget upon extracting it looks similar to this uh, there is a folder called screen pop within that folder will be a javascript file and an xml gadget specification file open the javascript file which is a small file that looks like this halfway down where we are building the iframe uri you need to modify the source and replace it with a text similar to what you see here uh, google.com slash custom and provide the call variables that you want to use in the search in our example here uh, similar to workflow based approach we are making use of call variable 4 and 5 save the JavaScript onto your web server and the last step is to go back to finesse administration and add the gadget spec into the desktop layout so click on desktop layout uh, either agent or supervisor role is is fine uh, in our example here we are using an agent and in the agent section we added a, a new tab and we called it screen pop and provided the address of the gadget spec and click save and this is all that's needed in the admin interface you can sign out and switch to the agent and log your agent in an agent has a screen pop tab activate that tab and make the agent ready <coughs> and send our test code to the agent great our um, workflow based screen pops is still operational as as you can see uh, let's switch back to the finesse agent desktop and our screen pop gadget is populated with the search results from Google again using our call variable 4 and 5 Brookline weather this is also a very simple to do screen pop gadget that you can add uh, in a few simple steps okay this is the end of our demonstration thank you for watching